back day at the gym, sipping on what looks like dirt, but it's actually game day, new pump, <laughs> and creatine all mixed together. Cool thing about man sports is they don't use artificial coloring, so sometimes you mix up enough shit and it looks really weird, but it's all good. We don't need the artificial coloring anyways. So yeah, I'm gonna kill this back day. We got, was it thickness focus? Yeah? Yeah. So back day, lots of growing, lots of growing. slowly and just like controlling the weight and really unsure about they look unsure like when they're lifting they're confused maybe they need to lifting I don't know but when you're lifting lift explosively okay so explode up slow and control down you notice how when I when I'm pulling the weight I'm exploding up I'm not my chest is slightly lifting off the pad but not so much when I'm engaging my lower back and I'm squeezing retracting and as I come down, nice slow and controlled. Weighted pull-ups next. You guys want to get wide? Weighted pull-ups. I've seen the best lat development in my life doing weighted pull-ups. If you guys can't do any pull-ups, even body weight, watch my video on how to get good at pull-ups. I learned from that. But once you get better at pull-ups, add that weight, even if it's just even if it's a two and a half pound little plate that you're strapping onto your waist, just slowly keep increasing. So let me teach you guys a little bit about lat insertions. You guys hear that a lot. I don't think I've seen anyone really like physically show people. So anyways, lat insertions is where your lats start. So as you can see, right here, my lats start up here. Okay. Um, a good example of someone with really low lat insertions would be like Chris Jones. His lats attach like down here. Anytime you see someone's lats where they attach damn near their waist, they're gonna look wide as hell. But the higher your lats attach, like mine's aren't like super high, I've seen worse. Mine's are kind of like in the middle. But whenever the higher up they attach, the harder you need to work on getting wide. Because it's all about, you want that V taper, right? So obviously the lower they attach, the more V taper you have. So that's why for me it's a big lagging. Um, it's one of my lagging points. One, because I'm a narrow frame. And two, because my, lat, my lats insert a little bit higher. Also, genetics. You can't change them, but you can make the muscle grow. Rose decks. Turn your wrist out, get that stretch at the top, supinate up, thumbs up at, at the top of the rep at the bottom, turn your wrist out, get that nice stretch and squeeze. I like to stagger my legs, so whatever arm I'm doing, I have that leg in front. Reason being is I can just power a little bit more, and with my opposite leg back, I can retract as I come back more, as opposed to being stuck against the pad, I can retract and pull my elbow a little bit further back, getting that fuller range of motion.
next exercise, low rows. The only piece of advice I have for the low rows is don't forget to engage your lower lats. Arguably, well anything you ro you're rowing that low, you should always engage your lats or any row in general. I actually feel it probably more in my lower lats than I do like my center back on this exercise. Um, so just don't forget to squeeze your lower lats. Remember V taper, you're going to work your lower lats. Um, yeah. And yes, I'm glowing like a fucking night light up in here. Um, you guys want to lose 5 pounds immediately, just get a tan. Exercise incline dumbbell curls. I have like a knot that I've been working out on my forearm, so it hurts a little to curl heavy. Yeah, for that bit. <laughs> no, I found my left hand. Left handed, right? Um, anyways. Secret. <laughs> Secret to the <laughs> gains. Yeah. So, I'm just going light with the incline dumbbell curls, and I'm doing my little double rep thing. So, come down, lay down nice and slow, and I'm not even counting, I'm just going until I can. It's fucking loud down here. I did that for like four sets. Next we're doing some drag curls. And call it a day. Split the rope at the top. does the scouter say about his power level? It's over 9,000!